Hi everyone, welcome to my video tutorial. In this video, I will show you how to write a pretty URL for your website with that AT access file. And I have three main points to show you. The first point, I will change from this URL to this URL. And the second one, I will change from this URL to the new beautiful URLs like this, which have two parameters of that and ID. And the last one is redirect uh, not found error to a specific name. Okay, let's get started. So I use uh, I'm using VAM as a saver, and I already created a folder named routers in the saver folder. And right now you can see it's have it's empty, nothing in here. So when we go uh, this URL in the directory no file right okay so let's open uh, this folder with tech editor i'm using a uh, visual studio code so i'm going to create a new file named post.php and i will write some uh, things like uh, i can to commit tutorial and for php part I would like to display a string uh, like post ID and, and that's it and save and go to that file that I just created it's named post.php right yes it comes like this and now I want to add a parameters ID which have what you want to see and it's display the same right now I'm going to add uh, to display uh, the value of this parameter next to uh, this string. So let's go back to the editors and join uh, this string uh, uh, using get, which uh, receive the value of ID parameter, right? So save and refresh and reload, and we can see like this. So we can change any number we like okay you can write any number you want or take or something like that but in this uh, tutorial I just uh, use a number only because it for ID right okay so now I want to change change to a new a pretty new URL like this but what happened not found right because we don't uh, give it the power yet so to fix it going back to tick editors and i'm going to create a new file name that at access that i has mentioned before and it's just a file but it have power to change the setting or the savers and in and it can also do many different things for your website so i will write rewrite engine and on and rewrite rule space and so in this line i want to change i want to i want to change from this url to this url right so the new url came from this new uh, this URL right okay rewrite row new URL space or URL right so this value came from this module so this is uh, can become uh, parameters that we use dollars as a parameter one right so this uh, should be uh, use the uh, sorry use the digit number okay so let's save and refresh the page okay it comes up so use last a number but look here it have something like uh, two digits after number three have cut out so to fix it we just add a plus after square bracket which can have more digits right and save and refresh the page right every number it comes out you can put long number you want all right it's work so the, let's go to 
the second point I will change from the UL to the UR, right? So let test when I go in and input this URL, it display the post ID only because the parameter ID it has the module, right? So I need to add another uh, parameter module into the body. Okay, so let's go back to post post.php and I'm going to duplicate and change the, the top one is for that and this it should be parameter of that the module of that parameters so right now I'm going to reload okay it comes out but it's uh, a little bit hard to read so to make it easy I'm going to display uh, horizontal line uh, horizontal line in the mid uh, before the ID so it's made more easy to read right so this is the the year that we want the four digit right so you can change any that you want any uh, ID you like it, we can see the result here okay and but what we want what we want is to make it into a pretty new URL like this right so if I input like that what will happen something wrong right um okay the not is let's go back to take editor and go to that AT access file in this point we want to make into this URL, right? That is the new URLs, and this is uh, the uh, URL that we that is come from. That it's come from. So it have two parameters: that and ID, right? Okay. So for the that, I will write like this. So so it have a year, right? should be a four digit and thus uh, so they and it have two digits and thus so the again and also two digits it uh, for the dead finish and right now it's for the ID it's just a number so I just put like this that's came from uh, this this point it can be uh, only number that came from zero to number nine and we have to change the dead as the parameter uh, as the variable one and the ID is for the variable two and let's save and go back to browser and reload the page okay we can see the results like this right so we, we can change any number of here and of here and enter this camera right and when you put only uh, one uh, what you ask parameter it will not found like this so let's move to another point here so for not uh, files like this, we're going to uh, redirect to uh, this page. So I'm going back to take editor and create a files name not found.html that will display uh, something that when the users find something but it's not found. Okay, so I will write some things. body tag I would write something in heading one sorry the link is not found save it okay we just refresh but it's still the same so when it's not found like this I need it to redirect to the file that I just created right so going back to, to get it and 
uh, open the .xt access file and enter to a new line and write something like this write something like error documents for 04 so what we want is go to not farm go to this link right so just copy this link and paste after it and save so now I uh, write something uh, the dead like this it's working because we write the correct URL right 2005 something like this but if I just type 3 wrong if I type only uh, 2501 or 99 like this uh, here cannot be only two digit it have to be four digit so when we write the wrong format like this it will go to the wrong uh, to not found link that we just put in that AT access file that is for my tutorial for this video thank you for watching and if you like don't forget click on like this video and help subscribe my channel to get a new video for the future thank you for watching goodbye